Hi guys, today I want to discuss with you Fall in Love collection from Louis Vuitton. Please stay with me. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Thank you very much for clicking on this video. I truly appreciate it. If you're a new visitor to my channel, I definitely love you to stick around and maybe even potentially subscribe to my channel because I do lots of review of the handbags, fashion, etc. But I'm complete fanatic for the handbags. And obviously, if you're a return subscriber and supporter of my channel for a long time, thank you so, so very much, guys. I truly, truly appreciate you. Today, I want to discuss um, one of the newest Louis Vuitton collection. I believe it's going to launch in um, July this year, if I'm not mistaken. Problem a little bit with this collection is that it looks like it's not going to be available in all the countries. It looks like that it's going to be available in China and in US. I'm keeping my fingers crossed, maybe it's going to be available in uh, Canada, hopefully in Europe or Australia, we will see, we will see what's going to happen, but I just want to chat about this collection a little bit. I got some photos from Instagram and mostly all the photos are credits to Foxy LV. If you don't know Foxy LV, then you're definitely not in love with Louis Vuitton. <laughs> because she is the biggest, biggest fan of Louis Vuitton that I ever known. I mean, we all love Louis Vuitton, but she is true fanatic of Louis Vuitton. And I have several pictures. I was contacting my SA trying to get more information about this collection, but no luck. Um, she didn't provide me with any further information about this collection, but nevertheless, let's discuss. And the first handbag that I want to discuss is on the go. And I'm going to put a picture over here. You know, guys, how much I love on the go. And currently I have two on the goes in my collection, both of them in MM size, because for my body frame, I find that this is the most appropriate size. But obviously in the canvas that I have, it's combination of reverse can canvas and giant monogram canvas, let's put it this way. And then I have in imprint leather in black. But this uh, handbag, let me just, um, actually make it this is the first time ever they actually did in actual monogram the the proper monogram print and it looks like on the side it's just a black leather with obviously black leather uh, handles and you know writing of the Louis Vuitton and red some kind of back uh, charm which of the lipstick and I saw some comments on the Instagram that people saying it looks pretty much as uh, um, Christian Le Bouton there is there is a little bit of kind of like touch of it but frankly I really really love it I, I really really love it I mean the whole combo and as I said, if money is no objections and I want to get third on the go, <laughs> this definitely will be the option. And I like that, you know, that back charm, if I don't really want to have that um, kind of, you know, lipstick back charm, it's very easy to remove. And obviously you can put any other back charm that you like. Really, really, really love it. I was trying to find a picture on Instagram if there is any available of um, Never Full or Speedy, preferably Speedy 25. If by the time I'm gonna put this video and I'm gonna find these uh, pictures, I'm gonna put it somewhere over here, but most likely no chance. But once again, my assumptions that the um, Never Full going to be pretty much the same 
they're gonna have the same elements as on the go except it's going to be never full and i think it's going to be absolutely gorgeous when it comes to speedy hopefully speedy 25 if they're gonna produce it's gonna pretty much have the same elements maybe size going to be black the way i see it and everything else obviously with monogram and that gorgeous writing of louis vuitton in red absolutely absolutely gorgeous combination i don't think you can go wrong with this combination next handbag i think it's kind of worth mentioning especially because of the name of this collection fall in love it's a heart shape handbag and the heart shape handbag gonna be actually in canvas and in emperor leather so the canvas one i'm gonna put it all, all like over here somewhere picture once again if that's your cup of tea if you like unusual shapes i think it's absolutely gorgeous handbag but then i really love that kind of soft pink with little bit of uh, heart um you know kind of almost scribble of the heart on the side really really gorgeous and what i noticed also they're doing some kind of slgs in the heart shape for this collection really gorgeous i'm going to put all the pictures of the heart shape handbag slg is somewhere over here and that's what i said like you know if you are the person who likes to collect unusual shape of the handbags i think this is absolutely gorgeous and i highly highly recommend i don't think you're gonna go wrong with this um either of these monogram leather or small leather goods i think all of them are really nice the next handbag in this collection is the thin and once again i love it because previously when they did the thin it's always in some kind of brownish orangey shade of leather in the trims but this time it comes in black and once again writing of louis vuitton and i love gorgeous red interior i think it's absolutely gorgeous handbag the thing is getting really really expensive it was expensive from very very beginning when they introduced uh, keeping in mind it was 50 percent of uh, canvas handbag but now it's getting even more expensive but nevertheless i think it's a beautiful handbag and i'm gonna put pictures over here if you love the thin style you will be in love with this specific one i think it's absolutely gorgeous uh if you're looking on the side of something a little bit more um reasonable in price i think sac la plat i hope that's i uh, pronounce it correctly is going to be also available in this collection i'm gonna put it let me just find the pictures of that one i'm gonna put the pictures over here i think it's absolutely cute i mean for somebody who is young and vibrant it's it's absolutely cute unfortunately i couldn't find any pictures of the shoes from this collection but i assume it has to be like you know some kind of sneakers in this style doesn't make sense to me if they wouldn't do anything so I think it's going to be really gorgeous combo just getting some handbag and the sneakers that match in this um, handbag you're going to be set for many years to come you know uh, to to be really fashionable putting these two items together um i want to know what you think of this collection do you like it or dislike it i personally i personally think it's going to be a hot hot uh, collection it's going to be hot items they're going to be sold really quickly and i predict that they're going to sell overpriced uh, on the second market that's my prediction i could be wrong i want to know what you think do you really like this collection or you are absolutely hate it please put your comments below are you planning to buy anything from this collection once again i want to know if you're planning to buy anything and if you're planning to buy what you want to buy from this collection once again put your comments below i hope that you enjoyed this video if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to give me likes please consider subscribing maybe even subscribe right now return to my channel and i will see you on my next one bye bye